What's up, YouTube? Ray Ray back for another episode of Stoner Rants. This is Stoner Rants 7. <laughs> I just got done checking uh, my stuff. Not too not too long ago today, I had someone comment my my first video. My very first video. I'm gonna kill that nigga. <laughs> Straight up. I'm tired of fucking people with their fucking their fucking stupid bullshit comments like what the fuck is with people you faggot you homo oh you should run for president you're an idiot oh, oh, oh. well okay if you're gonna call me an idiot why do you tell me to run for president and if you're trying to say that sarcasm what's the point in using sarcasm typing how is someone gonna read sarcasm dumbass uh and what is with these fucking people you know they, they're just, the whole world's a bunch of fucking shit talkers. Like, I was watching this little kid fucking, you know, do some lip singing and stuff. He was, he was funny. He was a funny kid. He was doing, uh, Oops I Did It Again by Britney Spears. It, it, it was a little five-year-old boy with glasses and stuff. And he was dancing around singing, Oops I Did just lip singing. And it was just funny. He was doing funny videos. Like, he wasn't trying, you know... To be like, oh look, I'm a good singer. No, he was just trying to do funny videos, make people laugh. Kind of what I do. I want to make people laugh. Well, the comments I seen on that fucking video made me want to fucking puke. That's how bad they were. People talking shit on a five-year-old. Telling this five-year-old to go die, to go kill himself, to go bury himself in the ground, and he's a little faggot and a little piece of shit, and he's worthless and st should stop making videos, and all this shit. What the fuck is with you guys? Do you have like, do you, do you like look in the mirror like, damn, I'm looking in the mirror and I'm like, fuck, you know, I look like shit. I look like a piece of shit. I fucking hate myself. But you know what? You know what? I'm not going to make myself feel bad. I'm going to go online and I'm going to talk shit to this little five-year-old kid. I'm going to tell him to go die. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to call him a faggot and tell him to go die. What the fuck? The fuck? Fuck that. Like, straight up, fuck that. You know, you guys are fucked up, man. A five-year-old little boy. And I told that kid, I straight up told that kid, I was the only one that told him. If anyone fucks with him and he needs someone to, you know, back him up, I'd be that person. I'd be the one to back him up. I was the only one that said that. And you know how many dislikes I got on that comment? 10,000. I said I'd back him up. What the fuck? You guys piss me off so fucking much. Like, I, I just want to go with an 11, maybe 15 minute rant just cussing you out. Just cussing. Straight cussing. Nothing else. No talking like, oh yeah, this, this, this. No, straight up cussing at you. Talking shit on you. Talk about shit about you, your mom, your sister, your fucking third sister from a frog. I don't fucking give a shit. You're like, what is with you guys, you know? They're... I mean, yeah, there, there's people out there on YouTube fucking, they're fucking funny as hell, you know? Like, Destinate, Make Me Bad, 35, of course, the most known one. Most known one! Fred! Right? The high-pitched fucking annoying piece of shit Fred, right? He's, okay, his movie was kind of funny, but that's all I fucking liked. That's all I fucking liked was a little bit of his movie. Other than that, I was just like, dude, I need a fucking Advil or fucking, I need a Vicodin, that's what I need. Fuck, fuck Vicodin, I need a fucking Xanax. Damn, giving me fucking headaches and shit. You know, what is with people making videos with a high-pitched voice? What is with the high-pitched voice? <coughs> what, like, do you guys really think a high-pitched voice sounds, like, really good? Because if so, you're looking at the right person for a high-pitched voice. I don't use no fucking editing shit. I can talk high-pitched by myself. <laughs> but that shit's gay, and I don't do that shit. Fuck that. If I want to be famous on YouTube, I'll be famous ranting. I'll be famous scraping. I'll be famous smoking. I'll be famous rapping. I'll be famous fucking dancing to techno and shit. I don't give a fuck. I'll be famous my way, not with some fucking technology editing shit. With fucking, you know, I'd want me to be able to accomplish shit. That I could go downtown and be like, 
oh yeah, you know, that was me. I did that. They're like, no, uh, can I see? And I'd show them right there. If someone were to go up to you, Fred, Fred, or make me bad, I, I want to know. If someone were to go up to you, be like, hey, Jimmy, hey, Fred, oh, how are you guys doing? Are you guys seriously going to be like, hey, guys, how are you doing? Or are you going to be like, hey, what's up, how you do? You know, you're going to be talking in a normal voice, not a fucking high-pitched voice. What the fuck is that shit? You know? I mean, if anything, make me bad is way funnier. Because he doesn't really use editing stuff that much. And plus, Jimmy is just fucking funny. He pokes chicks in a butt with a flag and shit. Oh, not really with a flag, but with his finger. But still funny. If he had the balls to, he, you know. I only see Fred on there, you know, cussing and stuff about a magical giraffe shitting fucking Big Macs. You know, jerking off a giraffe's tail and shit. That shit's kind of, you know, it's, it's fucking funny. But when someone's making a video about being in a pool of lettuce, the fuck? The fuck? Fuck that! That's what I say. Fuck that. Straight up. That's my quote. If you guys haven't noticed that's my quote by now, then there's something wrong with you. Because I say that shit in all my videos. I say fuck that and what the fuck is that shit. Like, straight up. I don't fuck around. Like, you know Shibby 845 I appreciate your comment on my first video, but shit talking? Really? And you know what's funny? You know what's funny? And didn't I tell you this, dude? I told my brother, I told him. I was like, my first comment, I guarantee my first comment on my videos will be someone call me a faggot, a homo, or an idiot, or some other stupid shit. And I was right. What is with you guys? Seriously, do you guys not know how to post nice shit? Do you guys not know fucking, you know, respect or anything? You guys fucking talk shit all day on people? No, hell, I could go around talking shit on people all day, too. I'm like, hey, the fuck kind of shirt is that? Red shirt? That's fucking ugly as fuck. It's all about blue, cuz. You know, talk shit on people. That's a fucking ugly shirt. I hate your fucking hair. You know, that's fuck. Why would you do that? You walking down the street, you see an old lady with a, a purse that, you know, looks like it's snakeskin. You're like, the fuck? You killed a snake for a purse. That's fucked. That's fucked. The lady's like, I bought this at JCPenney's. And you're like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Stupid old lady, that's snakeskin. You really gonna do that? No. The fuck is wrong with you? Old lady's on the ground. Why'd you hit me, Sonny? Oh, uh, because you have a snakeskin purse. JC Pennies. Why don't you go hit JC Pennies? They have it. Fuck. No. You, the world's crazy. I, <laughs> listen to this shit. Okay. I wanted to help that five year old kid out. But there's this kid that I, I tried helping out today. The t I, I didn't know he was 10 until he told me. I thought it was funny. So this, it was the, actually a girl trying to get with a guy. I keep calling it, it uh, him. But, um. She was on, in a chat room. Oh, I'm trying to get with this guy, and I don't know what to do. I gave him a Valentine's gift, but I don't know what to do after that, and blah, 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 blah. Everyone's giving her advice. Everyone's giving her advice, right? Until she's like, oh, and I'm 10. Everyone shut up. And I was like, wow, you're 10? What the fuck? I was like, here, here's good advice for you. If you're 10, and you're trying to be with someone, stop. Straight up. Stop. Don't start at 10. I'm serious. You'll fuck your life up. The best thing to do is if you're t if you're 10 years old and you see the girl or the guy of your dreams that you you're like, "Oh my god, they're so beautiful. They're so hot. Oh my god, blah blah blah." You know, when I get older, I want to, you know, <laughs> oh, but wait wait till you're at least 17. At least 17. There's girls out there that are sluts. Straight up, dressing in short shorts, fucking walking down the street with their ass hanging out, freaking like 15, 16, 14 year old girls walking down the street like that. The fuck? I went to the mall. I'm 20 years old. I went to the mall. I'm walking around the mall. I see this hot ass chick. She's taller than me, big titties, nice ass, wearing a short skirt and stuff. I'm like, damn, this girl's fine. I was like, damn, this girl's fine. I walked up to her. I was like, hey, girl, you know, what's your number? This was like way before I got back with my girl. So 
you know, I know my girl's probably watching this video gonna trip about that. Way before I met, got back with you, baby. But I went up and I started talking to her to get her number and stuff. Guess how old she was? Twelve. I backed the fuck up. I was like, the fuck. I turned around and walked away. I walked out the fucking mall and I smoked me a cigarette. And I was like, what the <laughs> fuck is with this world? I was tripped out. Like, that bitch looked like she was like 25 and she was 12. What the fuck? And then I hear one of my exes, her sister, is fucking 12 and pregnant. 12 and pregnant? What the fuck? Girls are like, like, what the fuck is this shit? What is with you girls? Save that pussy for later. Damn. Straight up. Save the pussy for later. I know guys would be trying to top that, but seriously, trust me. Save it for later. Because if you save that shit and don't let no one touch it, in a couple years, there's going to be one guy coming along and you'll be like, damn, all these chicks are sluts. They're all ill, gross, you know, fucking loose and shit, all that. And then you're going to be the one girl that'll be like, I'm still a virgin. And they're like, no way. And they go after you. Don't be going after guys trying to make yourself all slutty and shit. Let them come after you. Hell. I'm happy with the one I'm with. But I don't need no one else. I've been through so much shit. Like, fuck. Uh, fuck all the other women. I'm sorry, women, but fuck all you other women. I love my girl, Purple Fire. She's the only one I want. She's the only one I love, only one I want. I'm loyal to her. Anyways, this is a 12 minute video already, so. Fuck you, Shibby845. The rest of YouTube, comment if you comment with a shitty remark saying I'm a faggot or a homo or some other stupid remark. Fuck you too, but right now you're cool. Shibby, I'm serious, man. Fuck you, Shibby845. Fuck you. Okay? Later.